Honourable Member for Calgary Curry. Mr. Speaker, so um, this is it, my last member's statement. Guess I'd better make it count. Guess I should try to say something profound, but I got nothing. Because nothing profound has happened in this place in over a year. Good point. We sat for 47 days last year, even on a four-day week, that's still less than 12 weeks out of 52. The old leader announced he was leaving, and then it took the natural governing party nine months to choose a new leader. In between, hardly anything of note was accomplished in or anywhere near this place. And since then, what's been delivered by this government has consistently fallen well short of what the Premier promised. A fixed election range instead of a fixed election date. An independent judge-led inquiry into this narrow little question of whether queue jumping is happening in the health system today instead of the wide-ranging inquiry the Premier led us to believe she would call. And as example after example of this government's arrogance, intimidation of, and indifference to the people it serves have come to light over the last several weeks, all we've seen is crisis management, where we should be seeing a commitment to real change in action. That's what the Premier led us to believe she would deliver if she was chosen to lead her party and this government. Real change really going through that tired, old, calcified government, cleaning house and bringing in a new culture, a new way of behaving, and a commitment to be bold and innovative. But, Mr. Speaker, nothing has changed, and it, it, it can't, as long as this government is in power, because, like the Tin Man in Oz, after 40 years, the thing has rusted solid. Only Dorothy can't get it to move again, no matter how much she uses the oil can, and who knows, maybe she doesn't even want to. At the, hunt for the, uh, at the end of the uh, Hunt for Red October, one of my favorite movies, Captain Ramius turns to our hero Jack Ryan and says, a little revolution from time to time is a good thing. Don't you think, Ryan? We have an election coming soon, and with it, the opportunity for a little revolution of our own. Wow.